Following the BP oil spill in the Gulf of Mexico, some of the excitement surrounding the oil and gas exploration and development in this province has turned to concern. Questions have been posed following the disaster what is in place in this province to avoid such a devastation here. All of this work helps to solidify Newfoundland and Labrador's reputation as a successful oil producing jurisdiction. Kathy Dunderdale said after outlining some of the successes and initiatives being put in place to advance development in the industry. We have what it takes to succeed and we are wide open for business. Moving on, the amount of identified hydrocarbon reserves in the Arctic is the world's third largest after the Persian Gulf and Western Siberia, Russian news agency ETAR TASS reported on Saturday. To this day, six major oil and gas provinces and two oil and gas fields have been discovered and the most likely estimate of the initial resources in them is 51 billion tons of oil and 87 trillion cubic meters of natural gas. The Deputy Director of Institute of Oceanology and Geological Matters, Associate Member of the Russian Academy of Sciences, Leopold Lovkowski, told the International Arctic Forum in Moscow this week. In general, the Arctic is the third world oil and gas province compared to the Persian Gulf and Western Siberia, said the scientist. Saudi Arabia needs to tame growth in its domestic oil and gas consumption, which are too big for both its population growth and the size of its economy, the central bank governor said on Saturday. Data shows that the kingdom's domestic consumption of oil and gas is posting continuing growth at in higher ratios. It rose by an average of 5.9% over the past five years, Mohammad Al Jasser said in remarks carried by the official SPA news agency. This is the high growth percentage compared to the demographic growth and gross domestic product, which gives a cause for research into causes of the increase in oil and gas consumption and worked to rationalize it, Jasser said. That's all the news making waves as of now. We'll be back soon with more news making waves. Till then, it's goodbye.